And what's up guys, welcome back to Let's Play Destiny. I'm Shadow Dragonic and let's continue on with the rest of the game. So now we have to head to... Are we going back to Old Russia Earth? Oh, wait. Iron Temple. Social. The ancient Fortress. Okay, so is that like another... Um... Okay, it's like another hub. Fair enough. But where is our next, um... I guess that is our next... Our next objective. Because there's nothing... No, I don't want to go to the tower. Alrighty then, let's go to the Iron Temple. And once again, guys, I have stuff going on in the background as well, so you'll have to excuse the slowdown and or, you know, stuff that's going on. Uh, welcome to the Rise of Iron. To unseal the record book that accompanies your adventure, press... Now press... Yeah, I know. All record books are located here. Opening the Rise of Iron record book by hovering over that. Uh... Okay. Okay, I guess break the seal? Iron armor arms, grants three pieces of days of iron arms, armor one per class. Leg armor. Okay. Iron rewards. Complete rise of iron milestones to rank up in the record book and earn rewards. Okay. Interesting. Get more active than ever. Let me go talk to the postmaster first, see what my uh What do you have for How me? How can I help? Lost items. Okay. Done, done, done. Please come back. We have to get a better understanding of what the Devil Splicers are up to. Vanguard Scout. Okay. Well, would you look at that? A Kavostov. Your first rifle, right? Got you out of a tough scrap back in the day. 
And with a manual. Hmm. I have an idea. Alright, find manual pages and... Uh... Kvostov parts on patrol in the plague lands. Okay. Head back out to the Cosmodrome. I'll pass your ghost locations where you might find some weapon parts. And the Fallen could have those missing manual pages. We have a real treasure on our hands. Splicer material. Siva key fragments? A Siva cash key. Okay. Bounties, uh, events completed. Till okay. next time, brother. Probably just the same crap. Yeah, same crap. There is no understating what we're up against. Guardian, my fellow Iron Lords died fighting to keep Siva contained. Since that day, I have kept watch for its return. For the day we'd be required once again. Long ago, the flames on this mountaintop stood as a symbol to humankind. That the Iron Lords would protect them. If the need has arisen again, I think you should be the one to relight the fires. Very Lord of the Ring-ish. Long ago, the flames on this mountaintop stood as a symbol to humankind that the Iron Lords would protect them. If the need has arisen again, I think you should be the one to relight those fires. Interesting. Million million armor shader. Eh, it doesn't really, doesn't really suit gold spiral. No, they don't really suit me. Apparently I can sp Contains an iron banner armor piece. I have quite a bit of silver dust. Hmm. Iron banner armor piece, huh? A gift from the old traditions. Sure, let's buy a couple. Why not? May this help you in your quest. Farewell. Hmm. A dusty iron Ingram. Now, is there anybody here who can? I need your light, Guardian. Is there anybody here who can? The iron Siva is only one chapter. Consider my knowledge at oh, your okay. disposal. Let it aid in our mutual interests. Man, that is some slowdown. Let it lead your curiosity far. I apologize, guys. I really do for the whole slowdown. I will definitely not be recording and uploading at the same time again. There aren't many like it anymore. I hope it is what you need. Okay. Iron Regalia Vest. A piece of history to guide our future. Iron Regalia Mask. A fine treasure from the Cryptarch's archives. Iron Regalia Sleeves. I do hope it serves your needs. Iron Breed Sleeves. A fair trade, I hope. Alright, so I got two Iron Breed Sleeves. I'll be here when you return. Um, are they any good? I mean, obviously, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna... Three defense. The hell? Why does that piece of armor look like 
duct tape. Is that just me? Looks like freaking duct tape. It's it's sort of cool, but uh, I don't know. All right, just get silver dust back. Fantastic. That's kind of a cool mask, but not as cool as what I have on now. All right, well, let's, um... But shame won't keep me from seeing it through. Let's actually continue on with, like, the story here. Okay. That's my guy was kind of weirdly glitching out there. I think just for the hell of it, when I light the last one, I'm just gonna start dancing. I have a dead ghost. Where? Oh, hey, look at that. That was hidden rather well. And commence the dancing. Because that makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. But hey, we completed a quest, so let's go. You've never faced fallen like these devil's blazers. During the Dark Age, Lord Silamar and I built this temple. Right, so what do you have for me now? We haven't met yet. I'm Actually, we have. <laughs> That's... I was once the archivist in service of the Iron Lords. Saladin called me back because he believes my knowledge of what happened here could be of use. We haven't met yet, but we have because I've brought my engrams to you already. Uh, that scout the vanguard sent, Shiro. He asked me to look at the log you brought back. I passed along what I could gather, and now he's asking to see. Right. That scout the vanguard sent? Shiro? He asked me to look at those logs you brought back. Apparently, I'm the only one old enough to make sense of them. In any case, I passed along what I could gather. And now he's asking to see you. You here to fight or scout? Hey. We spoke on the radio. I'm Shiro 4. I run scouting missions for Cade and the Vanguard. Uh, those logs, logs you pulled, logs, logs you pulled, show a major fallen occupation in what Saladin's calling the Plague Lands. Let's send in a force to fight them. But we need someone to go in first and clear the path. Don't suppose you're interested? Sure. Those logs you pulled showed a major fallen occupation out in what Saladin's calling I read that already. The Plague Lands. I've had the tower scramble reinforcements, but we're going to need someone to guide them in. Don't suppose you know anyone who'd be interested. Right, so... Understanding your takes patience. Looks like that's all we have here. So let's go back to orbit. These fallen aren't going to back down anytime soon.
Uh, excuse me for a second. I'm not gonna stop the recording. I just need to check on something real quick. I will be right back. Alright guys, I apologize about that. Feel free to skip ahead uh, however long. I'll, I'll try and put it in the description how long to skip ahead to if you guys want to skip that part. Alright, so let's go ahead and... Going back to Old Russia Earth, into the Plague Lands. Clear the way to the heart of Siva Threat and open a new front on this war for other Guardians. Alrighty. The Iron Lords believe we could contain Siva by destroying the chamber where it was produced. These fallen must have restarted the process. We need to get back into the chamber and cut off the flow of Siva at the source. I think we need to focus on what we know. The fallen have occupied a military bunker in the Plague Lands. We won't get any reinforcements in that area until the fallen's artillery is taken out. The fallen are a symptom. Siva is the disease. All right. All right. Vanguard reinforcements are standing by, but until those guns are down, they can't leave the hangar. I need you to shut them down. Understood. Why did something tell me that there's something up there? I just have a feeling 
I have a feeling that there's something up here. Ah, I see I was right. I just had that feeling. All right, so now we're heading... Guardian, there's a dead vandal near you. Can you give me a scan? You want me to scan the dead vandal? He's fallen, basically, but armor is enhanced. Weapons have been modified. Cybernetic enhancements. Most fallen houses have a sect dedicated to this sort of thing. They're called splicers. They're like body hackers, bioengineers. Oh, it is worse than I feared. The splicers are not only using SIVA to transform this place, they are using its technology to transform themselves. Interesting. Right, it wants me to go that way. Why does it get dark all of a sudden? It goes from light to dark. Right, I don't see anything over there. I thought maybe there might be a, another ghost over there or something. But I'm not seeing anything. The Fallen have done some remodeling. They're taking the metal for something big. Hope they're not using it to toughen up those gun emplacements. Foundry 113. Well then, that is a gigantic servitor. I've never seen the Fallen do anything on this scale before. I'm calling for more reinforcements. You said yourself reinforcements will be useless until the guns are down. Besides, they will not be prepared for what they'll find. Hell's that? Oh, okay. A manual page. Oh, good. This can be shot. Good to know. It's interesting because you kill him and uh, you kill him and those orbs fly out of them. It seems like they only fly out of them when you get a headshot on them, so. Almost in a way like the game wants to punish you for shooting them in the head. Splicer shank. Alright.
Page 38. Alright. So how many pages are there to this freaking manual? I know I've got to be missing something out here. It's huge. One big ass freaking servitor is what that is. I thought SIVA was technology, but this. It's like something alive, growing, out of control. These devil splicers are using SIVA, but they cannot control it. They are like children with a new toy. I don't know of any toys that eat Russian industrial complexes. during the collapse. How did the Fallen... It's not the Fallen. Maybe it's not, but the Fallen are the ones pulling the triggers out here. The Vanguard wants them taken down, we take them down. Interesting. So, essentially, SIVA is bringing back old military technology. Because it is a weird organic, a weird organic, uh, computerized, I don't even know how to explain it. It's like a living computer. I heard them, but I didn't think they were the exploding ones. Splicer exploder shanks. Okay, just to be clear, I don't like creepy tech that spreads like a virus. It gives people the wrong idea about artificial life forms. Yes, well, that is very much so alive. Make sure there aren't any ghosts in there. Detecting a high concentration of SIVA shielding the gun emplacements. Even SIVA enhanced shields would require an energy source. But be careful, there's something familiar about all this. Right. Destroy the familiar generators, and then take down Shiro's zombie guns. And 
zombie guns. That looks like a... That's a big rocket. up there. Yeah, you run, you coward. Dormant Siva Cluster. Alright. Wow, my god. A lot of guys down there. Power levels are dropping. That's it. Shield is collapsing. You should be clear. Guns are upstairs. Take them out. Alright, I will do, but I want to have a look around first. If there's any more of those uh, Siva clusters anywhere. Or dead ghosts.
Right, well... If I didn't know better, I'd say the Splicers were creating a beachhead. Something of this scale could be used against the city. So, those destroyed guns? Siva undestroyed them. Undestroyed? Look for a central Siva node inside those emplacements. Destroy that, and it will break the fallen's hold on the gun. They are. Why wouldn't they be? while those guns are still up. What is that? A shock cannon. Oh my god. Poor creature. Alright, so you can't destroy the cannons. The zombie cannons. All right, let's go pick up another shock cannon. Since they're giving them to us, we might as well use them. I see you in there. I saw you in there. I'm pretty sure that air support isn't going to get here in oh. time. <laughs> the perfect walker. That's great. Alright, there's 
another cannon. Go grab it. Selling it. It's directing the corruption to resurrect the guns. This isn't looking good for me. It's probably gonna be a game over. Just hide. Have a knife, you bastard. Just die. All right, I think it's dead now. Centuries passed and I have learned nothing. Shiro, can your forces secure that area? We'll do our best. Try. I need the Guardian to return to the temple. If we are to avoid the mistakes which led us here, he and I must speak about the fall of the Iron Lords. Oh, am I gonna make it? 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 Ah, uh, yeah, get it. Nice. Oh my, what a freaking mission.
Come on, game. Don't fail me now. This may not make sense to you, but it took your fight to remind me that immortality is not the same as invincibility. I don't understand. When the ghosts first found us, those who were chosen were blessed with power, but not wisdom. The Iron Lords came together in search of a solution to mankind's struggles. Instead, we found Siva. We dreamt of using Siva to build starships, colonies. We would become what the Traveler always believed we could be. But something happened. Siva had been lost to time. When Teemer tracked it to the Cosmodrome, we thought our quest was finally over. Siva would be ours for the taking. Rasputin responded. More than a hundred Iron Lords entered the Plague Lands. Only nine reached the Replication Chamber. But since we were chosen by the Traveler and our cause was just, we were certain the day would be ours. Until Siva took control. It infected our weapons, our armor. The corruption puppeted us against one another. In the end, Yolder sealed the chamber with the Iron Lords inside, rather than let Siva escape. The battle was won. Heroes died. And our mistakes stayed here. But Rasputin survived. This is not Rasputin. But neither is it something I know how to fight. They are using Siva in ways we never even imagined. How would the Fallen have learned more about Siva than the Iron Lords? Or better yet, where did they learn? They haven't mastered Siva yet. This is all still new to them. See Tyra. She studied Siva's origins. If there's a way to track the Fallen's discoveries, she will know where to look. Alrighty then. The sound kind of cut out. Not sure why. There we go. Now is it going to throw me right into another mission? Oh no, it's gonna bring me back here. Alright. Well, that's good, because I'm gonna end the episode here, guys. So, thank you for watching. If you guys enjoyed this episode or previous episodes, please give it a like. If you guys enjoyed my Let's Plays, please don't hesitate to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Destiny Blind. But until then, guys, later.